this is a waste mill, waste water from rice mill, power boiling rice mill, uh, because of polyphenols coming out of lignin. Okay, the color is brighter, br bright yellow. Okay, so standard COD BODs are on the higher side. COD is three thousand plus. BOD is one thousand plus. TSS is around uh, eight hundred between 500 to 1000 pH is basically this initial pH was 3.5 treated now. with microbes and aerated for uh, more than 12 hours we to add a little bit of coagulation and try to float it uh, try for the flotation okay so coagulation has, star has started initially now <coughs> the sound that you are hearing is because of the venturi venturi suctions so submerged the aerators with venturi is put a pushing in the air. Microbes are there. So now you can see the coagulated flocks floating up and gathering on the top. You can see the flocks coming up and floating. It will take some time for all the flocks to uh, because it's a demo, it's a it's a small lab model, it's not uh, uh, totally efficient. So we can't give 100% micro bubble in case, in that case, it would have been floating within a few minutes, but it will take some time. So we'll come back and rejoin when they are all floated up. Coagulation is almost complete. pH is almost 7. And if we stop the aeration and circulation, we'll see exactly how is the coagulated particles. particle you can see them moving the coagulated particles now with more aeration it will start floating up And here is the sludge. So if we remove it a bit, so they are going to consolidate. You can see the movement of sludge at the bottom. Transparency has improved of the supernova, so most of the sludge has gone up. Still some left, and the air bubbles. These bubbles, sir, remember these bubbles, sir, very large in diameter. Water is becoming clearer at the bottom, sludge is gathering up, so now you can see the improvement in transparency. Even the uh, palms and the, bubble and the bubbles at the bottom, you can, you can have a look at it, you can see them rolling. And if you see from the top, you can see the liquid, you can see the improvement in transparency. If I close the bubbler, close movement, you can see almost down to the bottom. And you can see the sludge. We are going to uh, put in the air for a couple of more minutes. And then we will go for separation of the supernatan from bottom. And then we will start the filtration. Now it is looking good.
Take out the supernatant from the bottom. You can do it by a in the original plant, what we are going to do is that we are going to suck out the sludge from the top and then transfer the supernatant to secondary treatment tank for further aeration, which will improve the geo, which will improve the uh, transparency even further, and then it will be processed for filtration. Transparency is a clear polycarbonate jug, so it will give you a better idea of the transparency. We are transferring the supernatant. Second tank, once again it will be aerated with microbes. And you see the sludge is still floating. It's in the secondary, uh, secondary treatment with microbes and aeration. The supernatant has been treated. The geo level is going to increase, transparency is going to increase. Use is going to decrease. And from here, after this, we will start the filtration. Look at the transparency already. So the other view level will increase, and even smaller uh, particles will precipitate down. Microbes will take care of a lot of uh, view, uh, VOC, a lot of POC. Now we are going to start the uh, filtration. In filtration right now we are using a UF uh, hollow fiber membrane and a carbon block in series. So this is the water post aeration in the secondary treatment with microbes. We are starting the pump now. Okay, so now the water is coming via pump through the UF hollow fiber membrane. And from the membrane it is coming to the carbon block and you can see the filtered water it is even before the resins okay we are going to check out the transparency and quality before the, before the resin if you can find needed and you can see the marker tgt written down below it's a transparent polycarbonate uh, jar so at, at the bottom on, 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 the, on the paper the marker was given so that we can judge the transparency so Here is the water coming out. You can see the UF membrane. And there is a feed line coming from the pump. There is a submersible pump which is feeding the water. And you can see some small sedimentation at the bottom of the tank. It is uh, due to the secondary treatment and the aeration. So, precipitation has happened. Microbes has worked over here. The DO level is fine. It's already more than 6, 5.56. If need be, uh, depending upon which kind of norms it is, 
you, you can charge up the duo. And you can see still the market is so visible, the water is absolutely clear. This is the water after filtration through the uh, EF membrane and the carbon. You can see the marker at the bottom, water is absolutely clear.